Hello YouTube, and welcome to this week's episode of Brainstorm, where I give you a glimpse of what's new in the world of science. Our top story comes from the world of astrobiology. In the search for life on other planets, scientists usually look for signs of simple life, like oxygen in the atmosphere. However, there may be a way to identify exoplanets with complex Earth-like life. If other planets evolve multicellular life similar to trees, then it should be detectable. Because the shadows cast by trees can actually have a large impact on how much light is reflected off a planet. By measuring how much light potential exoplanets reflect at various angles to their sun, scientists could pinpoint worlds with forest-like environments similar to Earth. Our next story comes from the world of medicine, where researchers have a potential breakthrough in treating diseases that affect the brain. The brain-blood barrier mostly protects the brain from infection, but it also prevents drugs from entering the brain tissue, which means that ridiculously high doses are required when trying to treat something like Alzheimer's, for example. So what the researchers did was modify an antibody that normally carries iron across the brain-blood barrier to also carry a drug. The drug and delivery system have yet to go through human testing, but this method has potential to greatly increase the effectiveness of other treatments. And from the world of chemistry, students at Stevens Institute of Technology are developing rechargeable hydrogen batteries for soldiers. A big problem with hydrogen as fuel is that it's difficult to produce and volatile to transport. But the new microreactors the students have made can easily produce hydrogen from fossil fuels. This would allow soldiers to recharge their batteries with substances readily available on base and greatly reduce the weight they have to carry. Our final story comes from the world of biotechnology. Scientists at the University of East Anglia discovered the exact molecular structure of a protein that transports charged particles in bacteria. With this new discovery, they hope to create technologies such as bacteria-based fuel cells. This would allow for the production of electricity from biological waste. It also has applications in cleaning up pollution like oil spills and uranium. Well, that's it for this week's episode of Brainstorm. I hope you enjoyed it. Please consider subscribing, and don't forget to check all the links in the video description. Thanks.